Welcome back everyone to CK2 Plus as Empress Constance II of Francia. And as you can see, I've given out all my titles. We are um, right at the vassal limit, right at our domain limit, which is amazing. Um, for the most part, you've you've seen how I've how, how I've done this. I've given the uh, duchy titles to local lords, and where there were no local lords, I've decided to give it to some friends. Now, in for the most part, uh, you know, I could give it to local people, as you can see here. Uh, I've made this guy, uh, this guy, uh, Duke of Granada. And, and so on and so forth. I've given uh, this woman uh, the Duchy of the Upper Pyrenees as well as the County of uh, Foix because she is, well, she was kind of the only one in the area and also she is going to die and somehow we're gonna inherit, uh, which is weird, but that's fine. Um, yeah, other than that, I've, uh, I've made one change. I've given our friend uh, even more land. You remember I made him Duke of Clemson, but I've also made him Duke of Aquitaine and given him Bordeaux and Perigord. So he's really, really powerful. He kind of has... He's actually grown very, very powerful. He might even be the most powerful vassal in our realm right now because he's really got a lot of land. Uh, but it makes sense. I mean, he's our friend. I've also made him an advisor, and uh, so we'll see how things go from there. But uh, yeah, he's he's an excellent diplomat. I think he will he will do well. And he's Oxitan, so I felt like this kind of fits the best. Yeah, there's not really much else uh, we need to talk about. I did give Bourbon to a French dude who's very old and content. Um, and I did give some lands to Avorn. Uh, well, Auvergne. Auvergne. Yeah, anyways, uh, to them as well. So yeah, that's that. That's what's happened. Uh, why are you independent? I'm actually not sure, but your son is the Duke of Poitou. Okay, cool. Um, anything else we need to do? I don't think so. Are you still at war? No, I might get you as vassal. No! Oh, why do you hate me so much? Uh, attraction to Pox. If I was to send you a little bit of money, you'll probably accept. Yes, okay, so we're going to get a new vassal, uh, which could mess with our vassal limit. We'll see if that works out. Um, Defensive Pact has still there. Okay, so we're actually over our vassal limit. Not sure what we can do about that. But, yeah, Laws, Empress Rank, Base, Ruler Diplomacy Bonus. Hmm. Okay, we no longer have this, but Prosperity Faction likes us a little bit more. And we can improve some technology. All right, let's see what we've got. Legalism. I was like that. More decisions. Tolerance. I like legalism. And then I have no problem with siege equipment. Sure. Anything we can do, we kind of need to change our laws, don't we? We actually also need to ransom you. That's really cool. Uh, buy indulgence for our sins. I don't think none of this is necessary. Let's let's check our laws. Let's see what we have. Crown authority. We have a vassal limit of seven. Oh, so we lose vassal limit if we do that. Obviously, I don't want that. Um, we could we have free investiture. We cannot go for imperial administration. What do we need for this? Has a lot late. Mm. All of the following must be absolute rule, ruler war declaration, ruler imprisonment, sovereignty. All of this must be true? Hmm. Or has absolute crown authority. Conclave disabled. Okay, yeah, we don't have that. But we could maybe... Hmm. Is there anything that changes? No. Okay, so I don't, I don't know how we can really get more uh, limit here. If I... Okay, if I was to change this, we would get Vassal mod plus two. Banishment. I mean, I don't care about if the council can... I mean, banishment is just kind of fine. We'll give that to the council. This doesn't seem... Like a bad thing. 
I mean, it's giving up more power, but it's it's so, like, it just doesn't really matter much. Okay, uh, Duke of Tornova has usurped the title from this guy. I don't like that. Hmm. Send out a bust hunter, sure. Uh, Dave Hunt has come. A wonderful chance for the court to venture to the countryside in September, that's fine. Indulge in fine weather and allow the men to engage in their bloody sport. Yeah, that's uh, great. I don't think our husband is partaking because, yeah, he's in Croatia doing stuff. He's actually leading troops in Abydos, which is quite far away. We do need a new steward. Um, Duke of Huntingdon, sure. Why not? Um, and if you please were to collect some taxes, that would be amazing. There's still a war going on. Kent and Essex fighting. And obviously this Hereford dude still causing issues. Uh, she has been such an irritant on this hunting trip with not a single good word to say and always taken up the attention of the hunters. Does she not know who I am? Denise the Unfaithful. Of the house Bacamont Zunazir. Yeah. Um. Sure. She's going to be our rival. But we're also going to make a new friend. Uh, De La Rochelle Lambert. Sure. Sure, why not? Why not have a new... We have a new girlfriend and we have a new rivalry. I think that's cool. Now, she's... N Wait. Wait, who's our... Oh, you're our friend. I thought it was someone else. Your husband died. You should probably remarry. But I don't, don't know who. So I don't actually have anyone I can marry you to. But one thing that reminds me of is we should probably betroth our son, who's at our court, by the way. He should be... First of all, you should get a different tutor, which I can't do just now. I think he needs to be older, right? Yeah. Um... So, but what we can do is arrange a betrothal for... Oh, we can't. That's interesting. Isn't there, like, a young calling left? Like, don't you have a really young daughter, Agnes? Can't she get a betrothal? Yes. So, we're basically gonna plant callings in Croatia because we can. And I think that's really cool. So, Vislas Luff will be betrothed to a carling from a really young age. They're both very young. Oh, and there have been far too many rulers re lately regarding Duke Talison's supposed dislike of you, enough so that you're prompted to investigate only to discover you hate him as well. Rumors were spread by Roland. Hmm. Plot to take revenge. Sure, why not? And what do you want? The Duke of Anjou. Um... Countess of Maine. Okay. I guess we'll impress him with vague promises. Sure, why not? I don't want you to have more power. Um, a great feast will be hosted now in Paris. Uh, that's kind of cool, actually. And fortunately, that means we cannot go to Queen Alice's coronation. And there is the betrothal. Very nice. So, our son, the heir to Croatia is going to be married to a carling matrilineally. Awesome. Sure, we'll pay whoever. And what's this now? I found out nothing new and useful. Mm, I think we'll need something real. I don't want to just make up stuff. Uh, and sure, fire eaters. Cool. This is going to be just the best fast ever. Um, and yeah, everyone's invited. Now, there's probably going to be tons of people that want to come. Um, someone was just killed. Jordan. He was slain by Matthew. Okay, you should probably be considered Kinslayer. But that's fine. Someone has nothing nice to say. They should probably shut up, I agree. Uh, also, by the way, we can build a lot more retinue. And I think we should. Light cavalry. We need more... I mean, we don't actually have that much money. But sure, let's get all of this. Don't need any commanders here right now. 
But damn, that's that's amazing. Yeah, we're gonna build up our retinue as much as we can. This is gonna really hurt our income, obviously, for a while. You like the acrobats? That's amazing. And you should probably shut up. Hey, come on! I just made you a duke. How can you... Nah. Well, whatever. Uh, we've got some more prosperity going. And... That's just a bill. Ah, oh, Zinazio you're back on. Your... Uh, oh, it was your husband that died. Well, that's unfortunate. Hmm. But, uh, yeah, she liked them, so that's kind of amazing. And everyone else enjoyed it as well. Perfect. I do think we got a little bit of a... Um, um, you get the struggle focus there. And actually, you know what? You should probably get a different guardian. Someone who knows how to fight. But maybe not someone who's excommunicated. Maybe the Duke of Orleans. There you go. Um... One of our council... Uh, court chaplain again? Why do we lose them so often? I don't know. But I want you to research cultural technology in the capital, please. Um, still working on getting... Still working on getting uh, some booming going here. You've improved. That's so cool. Claim a county. Yeah, I would love if we could get... Oh, we have a level 5 hospital already. That's pretty amazing. Um, what's our disease resistance? 64... And flourishing minus 15. Ah, I see. But there's still a few things we can build. Disease resistance plus 2. Plus 2. Okay, a total of 6. Can go for a total of 6. And then probably like another 5 or something. So another 11. Hmm. Okay, the king of... Sardinia, Corsica. Yeah, we'll all attend. In fact, yeah. Yeah, we will attend. That's fine. And what do you want? My courtier. Judith. Marry your guy. Fine. Don't know. Okay, that's one of your family. All right. Yeah, that's fine. I have no problem with that. And what's, what's going on here? To be my new champion. Uh, Duke Lancelot of Normandy is no longer champion. You're the champion of Francia. Uh, I would rather keep my current champion. Yeah. Uh, what? That's interesting. Uh, I mean, I guess thanks that you want to be my champion, but I, I don't particularly care. King Dimitri. Yeah, long live the king. Mm, you were friends with, uh... But uh, uncle, uncle, you're friends with our uncle, so yeah, there you go. That's nice. It will be quite a celebration indeed. I'm certain. Now, uh, despite building up our retinue, we're actually still making money. What? No, yeah, we actually are at full. Hmm, that's interesting. Uh, maybe a few more archers wouldn't hurt. Um, yeah, okay, it's beautiful, okay, I, I want to have a few more cavalry there, French knights, and yep, that's a nice event, but I think I'm going to go home now, it wasn't all that impressive, to be honest. Okay, built one more of those. Okay, and you've actually won. Barry has won this war and has usurped this province. Wow, this is like this back and forth between Burgundy and Barry is actually really, really interesting. Our Chancellor, you know, he's Dutch and he's just kind of a... He's kind of a cool dude, to be honest, even though he looks like shit. But, um, yeah, this is... I kind of like this. It's cool. And you died in battle. Probably against uh, Barry. I like this rivalry going on there. But anyways, I love a good feast at my castle and I spent no expenses when I arranged the feast. The table is filled with geese, pork, cheese, and plenty of wine. Um, okay, we lose some money, that's fine. 
As I'm spending a pleasant moment along with the attractive cook, the wretched child Bartolome comes up upon us and promptly starts chiding me about morals. A six-year-old with a lovely, oh, the powerful voice. Uh, you know what? You should learn something about, well, no. Uh, learn some etiquette. You know what? Yeah, how about that? It does, it does matter. 70% no effect. There you go. There you go. Yeah. You, you should learn how to speak to an empress, to be honest. Okay, we do have a new ambition. Uh, we're now too old to get any children. Um, and I think I actually have forgotten to turn on support for my plot. Yeah, there you go. See, that's going much better. Um, let's see what we want to do. See the round prosper, building a war chest, which is... Hmm, national tax. I like that. Let's go for a war chest. And we'll just kind of save up money because we're going to do that anyways. And then... Yeah, that's going to be cool. You are now leading again? Nope. I will have you somewhere else. And we could extort our subjects. Don't think we will. There's no need. Yeah, you can kill this guy. This should go relatively easily. I mean, come on. How many supporters do we have? 366. Okay, yeah, he died. We just killed our rival. And he doesn't even know what's coming for him. Cool. Um, and I think he was also the one who killed... I think your husband? No, it was actually Mathieu. Ah, but still. It still works. Okay, anything else we could do? We could go for Grand Hunt again. Yeah, but... Okay, hold on. We kind of need to... Yeah, we need to build up that war chest, so we'll do that first. Once we have hit a thousand, we can we can spend the money again. But for now, we'll actually keep it. Uh, I think that's the best course of action. Um, Duke, my friend and my friend are rivals. That is not good. You're also friends with my spy masters. And I only have one rival left. Order her to take the vows. Wait, she's at my court. Um, heh, <laughs> plot to take revenge. Yeah, just take the vows. She's unfaithful. I think having her a nun is probably good. And leave court, please. Just go away. She's now at the court of over here. All right, enjoy that. Fine. Enjoy being a nun over there. I don't want you here. Just go away. I don't think we need to pay more attention to this little woman. Uh, she doesn't really mean anything to us, but I definitely want her gone. Okay. Um, I've never cared for the Duke of Hereford overly much, nor he for you, but lately your court is constantly filled with rumors and terrible things he's been saying about you. Ah, uh, now this is an issue. This is an issue. Okay, well, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. Pretty sure that we will kill our rival. Now, you're probably wondering, like, okay, I didn't actually, you know, I'm, I'm not killing people. I didn't try and kill people that often before. But I think at this point, we have nothing left to do. We an Empress, there's, there's nothing we can really accomplish that we haven't already. I mean, yes, we could conquer more things, but not really, because we're kind of at our vassal and domain limit. So we can't really do much more. So at this point, it's basically just keeping our realm together uh, to lose, apparently, fighting. What's going on here? Attacking. Oh, that's interesting. He's going to continue what uh, Duchess Teresa has started. But anyways, um, at this point, we don't really have much to do other than solidify our strength, uh, our, well, our rule. And I think killing this rival, who has to put, who first of all is a heretic, but secondly is a really, really experienced commander. Um, if he rises up against us, this could be really, really bad for us. And also, he took Somerset. Holy shit. I completely fucked over that woman. He took a duchy away. Okay. Yeah, so definitely we... Yeah, we need to do something. And I need to give Beatrix back her duchy and perhaps even a few counties. So if he dies, that would be amazing. <sighs> oh my god. Anything else? Yeah, I couldn't still extort subjects. I don't think I will do that. And... My spies believe they collect enough information that my plot should now have a better chance. Well, that's nice. Plot power increase and discovery chance plus 10%.
But that means I discover his plots, right? Damn, look at this. Holy shit. People hate this guy. Um, yeah, we'll approve the plan. Like, seriously. That's pretty insane. I hope it doesn't fail. But I doubt it. Uh, success. Mercenaries ambush the carriage of Duke Halson and make short work of him. Die, you bastard. And Duchess Ronan of Somerset has inherited. Well, this is interesting. So you did not inherit. Ah. Okay, and she's ambitious. Maybe I can marry her. Attempt a religious conversion. Through diplomacy? Hmm. Let's see if I can find you a good husband. Arrange a marriage. My courtier. No. Okay. Some of my... Yeah, you know what? You should probably get a proper education. Someone who actually knows how to fight. Duke of Sevilla. There you go. Um... Ha, that was not what I had planned. That's the Duchess of Hereford. Oh, it did get split. Ah, I see. So we have two duchesses now. Sanat of Hereford and Ravnan of Somerset. Ah, okay. Well, that's actually good. They might actually fight each other. That's always a possibility. Um, all right, I don't think we need to care about this, or we need to worry about this particularly. Okay, so yeah, there's no point in spying on our dead rival. We only have one rival, but she's sent away uh, to live as a nun, um, so I'm actually not really concerned about her all too much. All right, I think this is a pretty good place to stop. Um, what I will probably do going forward is actually going forward off camera, because there's not that much we need to do right now. We're basically just waiting for... Uh, sun to grow up damn the mongols are powerful and uh yeah that's kind of that we'll just consolidate our realm perhaps i'm going for increased authority i don't really know but that will be happening next time thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys then